I'm trying to... Salisbury, Salisbury, Salis, Salisbury. Hey guys, it's Jay, and today I am here with my most anticipated reads for November 2016. I have a total of six titles that I looked up, so without further ado, let us get started! As always, I tried to pick books that you guys probably haven't heard of. Because, you know, nobody got time to watch 50 million videos about the same books, like I say every time. The first book is actually one of the super popular books. I'm sorry, but like, way too excited not to mention it. And it is Heartless by Marissa Meyer. I was actually contacted to receive an arc of this, and I don't think anybody understands how excited I am for it to arrive. It hasn't come yet, but it will soon be in my possession, and just, your girl is ecstatic. This book is supposed to come out on November 8th, 2016, and it's a prequel to the Alice in Wonderland by Lewis Carroll. The book follows Catherine, who is the most desired girl in all of Wonderland, and she's even caught the eye of the King of Hearts, who plans to propose at the next royal ball. The only thing Kath wants is to open a bakery with her best friend, but her mother decides that this is not the proper thing to do for the girl who is going to be the next queen. At the royal ball, Kath meets Jest, who is the mysterious jester of the court. She finally feels something for another person. Risking everything, she and Jest actually start a secret courtship that may just cause everything to come tumbling down. So if that doesn't sound, like, amazing to you guys, like, uh, what's wrong with you? I'm just excited because Marissa Meyer is, like, one of my favorite authors, and the fact that this book is going to be in my possession soon, and I get to read it, and I just, <gasps> I'm so excited! The next book I'm very excited about is called Dead Girl Society and it is by Michelle Chris and it is also coming out November 8th, 2016. And the book follows a girl named Hope who has cystic fibrosis and she is sick of being babied by her mother and her overprotective best friend Ethan. And that's when this invitation arrives from the society and they're offering her a position to play in this little game of dares in order to win some money. She's hoping that she can use this money to pay for her medication that is very expensive. Hope accepts the invitation and she soon realizes that not everything is actually as it seems and that playing the game isn't really an option, it's more of a requirement. This book just sounds super cool, it's kind of got like nerve feelings for me, so I'm very interested in it because I did really enjoy Nerve, so we'll see if your girl likes this one too. The next book I'm very excited for is called Evelyn After, and it is by Victoria Helen Stone, and it is to come out November 1st, 2016. Evelyn Tester receives a phone call late at night, and she is informed that her husband, a very prestigious psychiatrist, has been in a terrible accident. She soon discovers that her husband was actually having an affair with Juliet, who is one of his patients, and she realizes that if the news of the affair gets out, it's going to ruin the perfect picture that she has formed for her own suburban life. So in order to protect her family, Evelyn stays very quiet about the affair, and she soon discovers that the night of the accident actually has a lot more consequences than just the details of a little affair. The more Evelyn learns about Juliet, the angrier she gets and her need for revenge gets stronger until she can't take it anymore. So like, I just want to know what she ends up doing because you know your girl is probably insane and therefore she gonna cause some shit and this girl really wants to know what that shit is. The next book is called Split and it is by J.B. Salisbury and it is supposed to come out November 15th, 2016. The book follows Lucas who experiences blackouts that he doesn't remember. The only thing he remembers about them are the feelings of rage and anger, confusion, and fear. He's found a very quiet life in Arizona and he's been able to keep his mind at bay for many years. That is until his boss's daughter Cheyenne comes into the picture and she's asking too many questions that are giving Lucas urges that he can't control. Lucas begins to get close to Cheyenne, but when the blackouts return, they unleash the secrets that he's been trying to keep hidden for years, and they may cause him to lose Cheyenne forever. This whole thing just gives me like the whole split personality like vibe, which, you know, like it's called split, so that's probably where I'm getting it from, but you know your girl love herself some like mental health stuff, so 
very, very excited for this one. The next book I'm very excited for is called Unnatural Deeds, and this is by Sin Belong, and it's supposed to come out November 1st, 2016, and it follows a girl named Victoria who has never really fit in with anyone except for her boyfriend, Andrew. That is until the mysterious Z comes to town and she wants to uncover all of his deep dark secrets. She begins lying to everyone she knows in order to unravel these secrets and that is when someone ends up dead and Victoria needs to come clean and she decides to tell her story to Andrew. And that's basically all the synopsis says. Is Victoria the guilty one? Is Z the guilty one? What's, what's going on with that? I need to know and therefore I need to read this book. I've also read another book by Sin Balog belong however you say it. it was it's called Sleepless I think something like that but it was about like the Sandman and it was actually really good it was like one of the first books that I read on booktube I probably talked about it in like videos from like way back so if you're interested go watch Fetus J talk about that book but it was good so I'm interested to see what else she's gonna write and the final book that I'm excited for is called Beautifully Broken and it is by Laura Lee and this is supposed to come out on November 15th 2016 this book follows a girl named Kat who starts an inappropriate relationship with one of her teachers, Mr. Cooper. And that's kind of all the synopsis says, other than like he saved her but destroyed her at the same time. So I don't know how I feel about it, but it sounds interesting and I want to know like what's going on because it's like, I was standing in the coffee shop four years later and I know that he destroyed me but also saved me at the same time. So like what did he do? I need to know. So, you know, your girl excited for that one as well. Alright guys, so those were the six titles that I'm excited for November 2016. I'm hoping you guys found ones that aren't that common and you haven't heard of. I don't know, maybe. If so, you're welcome. And I hope that you enjoy them if you read them. And I will see you all in my next video. Goodbye!